Pedro Gonçalves has got a team of the season card. Liganos released today as the minor league team of the season. And this card looks silly. Do you guys remember the goal he scored against Arsenal at the Emirates from the halfway line? What a goal that was. And man, this card looks insane. 93 pace and 97 dribbling. 94 for both shooting and passing. With 71 defending and 78 physical. 5 foot 8, high medium work rates, right footed. 5 star skills and a 4 star weak foot. He's got the finesse shot trait. He's also got the flare trait. And that defending is very nice to see because you could play him as a box-to-box -box if you wanted to because that defending is certainly good enough. His physical might not be good enough. But let's take a look at the in-games there. And he can play a lot of alternate positions as well. I think he comes out as a left wing, but he can play left mid, centre forward and right wing. So lots of very decent alternate positions for this card. And I bought him for a million coins. So he's very expensive at the moment and not going to be able to get him from red picks unless you are in elite which not, not a lot of people are. So if you want this card, you're probably going to have to buy him. And that is why we're going to be doing the review today to see if he is worth purchasing. His links are actually quite easy as well. We've linked him in here via Polinia, Nuno Mens, and Bernardo Silva, of course, with Hector the Gold Protector Bellerin in at right back, which is another very good SBC that I would recommend doing, by the way. He looks absolutely brilliant. And let's take a look at Pedro Gonzalez in-game. So, oh my God. 94 acceleration and 93 sprint speed. He's got 99 attack position and finishing with 92 shot power, 88 long shots. That should be 99. 92 volleys and 86 penalties. His passing is miraculous. 95 vision, 88 crossing, 85 free kick accuracy. 98 short pass and 92 long pass with 93 curve. His agility is at 96. 99 for balance, 97 for reactions and ball control with 96 dribbling and 99 composure. Very nice indeed there. He's got good interceptions at 84. A lot of what's bringing his defending down is his head and accuracy with 51 head and accuracy, 72 defensive awareness and 72 stand tackle. And his slide tackle is 63, which doesn't matter either. So his defending stats are actually okay. Interceptions are important. Defensive awareness and stand tackle are the only other ones that you really care about. And you can boost them up really nicely with a sentinel or something of that ilk. Jumping is poor at 52. Stamina is unbelievable at 99. Strength is okay for him at 71. And aggression is okay at 78. So, <clears throat> this card does look brilliant. I don't really know what chem style you should be putting on him. A hunter is quite tempting to boost the pace all the way up. But I feel like that would also be a waste. Don't need an engine. Don't really need to boost his passing either. So, hmm... I'm actually tempted to go for something like an architect. Oh, man, that's difficult. Maybe a hawk. Probably a hawk. But oh, that's, do you know what? That's actually one of the most difficult cards to find a chem style for, isn't it? You want to boost the pace. But an architect boosts the strength up so much. Let's apply an architect. We're probably not going to go with it. But I want to apply it just to see the boost that it does actually give across the board. So with the Architect applied, goes up to 99 vision, 99 short pass, and 96 long pass with maxed out curve. But it's plus 15 to the strength, which is up to 86 and 82 aggression. So that is a consideration for this card if you want, is the Architect. Um, I'm personally not going to go with that though. I, th I think I'm going to commit to the Hawk, I think. Um, but the Architect certainly could be justified completely. And, and I might change it to... The architect if i'm not enjoying the hawk but with the hawk applied plus four to the pace so up to 97 pace maxed out shot power at 99 goes up to 96 long shots as well and then gets a nice little boost to the strength again up to 75 gets 86 aggression as well guys we're going to be playing him in the 4 one 2 2 narrow as the cam let's get into a few games and see if this pedro gonzalez is worth a million coins but god damn he does look to be for cheap FIFA 23 coins, make sure to check out MMOEXP.com to get fast and reliable coins. And make sure you use code VIPER at checkout to get yourself a 5% discount. All right, guys, live game now with Pedro Gonçalves. I've got highlights for both new and old gen. This card's volatile. He's very good, but sometimes he performs like a bronze. N not in the areas you'd expect him to perform as a bronze. Like, it's, it's literally just his shooting. His shooting is so volatile. It's, sometimes it's absolutely unbelievable. 
and then other times you're like, what? Do you know what I mean? It's 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 a weird card so far. Uh, it's passing's brilliant. Defensively, in that camera, was always actually quite good. I know that sounds ridiculous. Oh, Giazzino, unlucky man. Oh, this guy's got a very nice team. Who's that there? Who on earth is that there? Get to that. Who is it? Lamella, okay. Oh man. Another sweat. I can't I can't not play sweats at the moment. I'm only like eight and oh on this account on, on uh in champs. And it's just sweat after sweat. <clears throat> and we're gonna celebrate too. Okay. Oh man, this is so sweaty today. All right, come on, Pedro. Show, show the people how good you are. That was really nice. That wasn't, though. No. Nor was... Oh, my God, please. Thank you. Nice. Sprint boost, please. Tough. Tough luck at the minute, guys. We were 2-0 down in the last game I played. Brought it back. Please get to it. Lads, you're pro footy players, and you're all... Team of the seasons. Okay. okay. Nice. Back into Pedro. Find that. Find that. Find that. Good ball. Can't really shoot from here though. We have to go backwards. Are we? Oh, he's read the cut back. I know I shouldn't have gone for the, the byline there, but I thought maybe. Good challenge. It's our ball as well. Somehow. That's our ball. I really don't know how, but. Right, let's drive into this space here. Get that back in there. Nice. Good football. No. See. I, d I don't want to complain. I don't want to complain. But this game is really, really driving me insane at the moment. Oh, oh. On Salvez. Nice. Good finish. You have to green time your shots with him. If you don't green time, his shots are very, very, very average. Oh, that was good play, though. Really good Alasco there. And yeah, an another demon, guys. So enjoy this game. Uh, if I don't talk too much, it's because I'm trying to concentrate. Because I want to get the rank one on here. You know, I don't really care about this account too much anymore. But nice, big willy. Oh, Chavez. No. Nice, Polinia. This Mateus is bad now, too. He's read me fair enough. Very good player again, guys. It's, it seems to be the way at the moment. One in there, nice, good ball. A little dink, nice. Well, Chavez, I need your support here, man. Go forward, go for. No, see what? It... I... I, d I don't know whether to just like moan or not, because I feel like I need to lay out a big moan here. Nice. We got, we're trying to wait for that run of Bernardo, but he just isn't going, is he? Nice. Plinia has got nothing on. This guy's offside. Of course, man. Gonchalves. Yes, what a pass. It's not Gonchalves, it's a Spinardo. What a pass that was from Son there. Lucky goal. Lucky goal, but I'll take it nonetheless. Oh, that's nice. All that dribbling there was nice. Oh, Bernardo, you dirty boy. Hold on. Over. Bang it. I absolutely hate when they hit the ball like that. Because I have not been up holding R1 there. That's just a game literally deciding what shot choice for me. If you get, if you get a normal shot there, like you do 9 times out of 10, that's 3-1 and get and game over. Do you know what I mean? And I guess we finally got our little moan there. Come on, Rio. Find that. Nice. Zinho. Okay. Sometimes it just really does feel like the game's against you. I'm not, and I don't think it's DDA. I, I just think the game just goes through its uh, phases. Nice, Pedro Gonçalves. He's right about Jezinho, and we're not looking there. Oh, Gonçalves! Oh, that's a lovely goal. A lovely, lovely, lovely goal. Oh my God, is he on side? Because that's a lovely pass. That's an absolutely brilliant pass there from Gonçalves. What a through ball. Oh. Oh, lovely from Gonçalves. This guy's going to leave. Let's get into another game. Oh, 
Got the Chavez. Oh, he's moved the keeper all over the shop. Guys, this is really tough. Everybody's sitting so, so deep on uh, Nugent at the moment. So, really struggling. Go on, Con Chavez. Please. What a finish out. It's green timed as well. Very nice goal there. This card's good. But he's having to play against a very low block all of the time. And that's tough. He's doing good, good stuff, though. Doing good stuff. Lovely from Gonchalves there. Nice goal, Son. He's a very, very good provider. He feels really good on the ball. He can drive into space really nicely. And find a really, really clinical last pass. Big. Gonchalves. Oh, my God. What a finish. Oh, my word. What a finish. Oh, yes. Gonçalves, I think, has been involved in every goal in this game. Really, really impressed. Gonçalves, that's got to go. Oh, my. How on earth has he missed that? Go on, Gonçalves. Gonçalves. Oh. Oh, my God, that sprint boost. Oh, my God, lucky goal. That sprint boost there from Gonçalves was really, really good. Not been the most impressive him on old Jenna. I mean, we're up against a very good player here. And we were 2-0 down in this game, so I'm happy to bring it back. His shooting's let me down a little bit on here, though. Jesus, look how fast he is. Oh, that's nice. How on earth have we not scored there? Wow, all there as well. Oh, Gonçalves. Oh, how are we not scoring there, man? Oh, but we've scored that. Lovely goal. His finishing's been, been crap. I can't lie. I, for some reason on old gen. This guy's moving his keeper and, you know, all, all of that stuff. But his finishing's been stinky. Oh! Oh, lovely through ball into Garincha here. Garincha. Garincha. <laughs> Oh, what a goal. What a goal. Hey, guys. So, review is in on Gonçalves. We played two games on new gen, two games on old gen. Four games, six goals, five assists. The card is absolutely unbelievable. His finesse shots are unbelievable. His long shots are unbelievable. His passing is unbelievable. And so is his dribbling. He feels very, very weak. 71 strength is um, very kind to him because he feels more like 40 or 50 strength. And if you don't green time your shots with him inside the box, I know he's got 99 finishing. He misses a lot. He misses a lot, a lot. So if you don't green time with him, you're going to have a few issues. So take that into account with this card. I do think he is the best minor league tots we've had on the game this year. Maybe other than Cristiano Ronaldo, but that's the team of the season moment, so I'm not counting it. I'm talking like Taliscas, cards like that. This Gonçalves is better than them kind of players. I would take this card over to this guy every day of the week. The other thing that's great about him is where we played one game of him at striker, and he was really good there as well. I personally think middle cam is the best best suited for him, but I also like the ability to play him as a box to box midfielder if you want to. I think playing on the left hand side of a four one two one two narrow or a four three two one in centre mid would work really well for him because he can't do the Travellers. You want to try and utilise his finesse shots because he's got great finesse shots and I enjoyed that about him. Um, I thought he was great on new gen. I thought he was great on old gen. But the fact that his shooting sometimes let me down. He was very volatile in terms of shooting. I couldn't quite believe it. Some of the shots he missed, you're going to see a few of them. I didn't want to put all of them in because I was raging hard. And we played a lot of sweats as well. So these games that we did play were a great test for this card. He's probably not worth a million coins. If he would drop down to seven eight hundred k, I would say go and pick this man up. He is fun to play with. He is very OP in game. 
If you do sprint boost, if you like good left stick dribbling on old gen, you're going to absolutely love him. And on old, on new gen, sorry, he's got really, really nice R1 dribbling. Some of the best I've used. I personally think these kind of cards here are better than Team of the Season, Team of the Year Messi, just because they've got similar dribbling, similar passing, similar shooting as well, and five-star skills on a four-star, four-star. So these kind of cards I would take over a Lionel Messi Team of the Season. And, you know, I, I, think, I think if he was Argentinian from PSG and was called Messi, he would be like three million coins. So great card, guys. New Gen, I'm going to rate him an eight and a half out of ten. And on old gen, I'm going to go for a 9 out of 10. Just be careful of his shooting because it is very volatile. Guys, if you have enjoyed today's video, leave a like on it, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the bell to post review. But guys, it's going to be it for me for now. So take care.